Uh, at Oklahoma City on Monday, they call feeder steers and heifers uh, kind of steady to a couple dollars lower on some of the uh, heavyweight heifers going to the feed yard. The choice steer calves, still the very best demand for those, uh, four to six dollars higher. We've seen some of that improvement uh, last week, had a good run of cattle in a, in a good market there. Uh, heifer calves uneven. Some of the heavier weight heifer calves calling those two to four dollars lower on Tuesday. Call slaughter cows steady. Instances two to four dollars higher. We should have a good uh, run of cattle again tomorrow. Expecting a fairly good market tomorrow as well. Other sales from yesterday. Donald Paskey from Ballinger had hair lambs weighed 55 and brought 250. Dean McMullen, Ariane, hair lambs weighed 64, brought 228. Struby Livestock from Wall had hair lambs weighed 70, those brought 236. Ruth Foster, Sterling City, hair lambs weighed 70, those brought 226. Uh, up in New, uh, Newkirk from up in New Mexico had kid goats weighed 53, those brought 308. Uh, Alfred Newkirk also had kid goats weighed 60, and those brought 294. Fields Ranch, Sonora, kid goats weighed 48 and brought 326. David Manning, El Dorado, kid goats weighed 45 and brought 338. Fields Ranch, Sonora, kid goats weighed 54, brought 292. Richard Hill had kid goats weighed 51, brought 326. And Richard also had another set of kid goats that weighed 63. And those topped out at 296. Once again, a big run of sheep and goats, over 7,800 head, no sale today. Join Lawn back here tomorrow morning at 625. This has been the Morning Livestock Auction Report, sponsored by Producers Livestock Auction Company.